Hey guys again, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be filming another mukbang. I just went and got some Thai food and I'm absolutely starving. So I'm just gonna quickly set it up. So I got some soft crab shells and I didn't know it was, it had batter in it and I don't think it's gluten free, but that's okay, I'll just have it. I think that sauce you put over it, some boiled rice, some more boiled rice, and fish cakes. I'm obsessed with fish cakes. So let's just get straight into it. Got my own cutlery. So I'm gonna quickly take a bite. I only recently discovered this. So delicious. Oh. Mm. Honestly guys, I don't know if I'm gonna eat that. I might leave it for Jason. I know this contains like a lot of things that I can't, that I'm intolerant to. But you know what? I might just eat it for you guys. Just for the sake of the mukbang. Yeah. posted a story on my Instagram and I asked you guys what topics should I talk about and I've got a few questions that have come through so my first question is now that you're married will you change your surname yes I've officially changed my surname I actually went to um, renew my license because it expired I gave them my wedding certificate and got that changed over. So I'll be getting my new card this um, in about a week's time. Um, and it was so weird. I had to sign my new signature and I only briefly practiced like while I was waiting in line. And I don't know. I don't know if I like my new signature, but yeah, I guess it'll do. I'm gonna say something but I forgot. Oh, this is so good. So, so delicious. Mm. Mm. It'll be like one week where I'm obsessed with a YouTuber and then it changes the next week. It always sort of changes, just depending on like what content they're producing, but for a couple, <clears throat> For couples, I'm loving Charles and Alyssa. Um, the royal family. Um, Juju and Dez. Oh, Destiny is such a good actor. Like when it comes to pranks, she inspires me. I wish I could act as good as her. For makeup, I still love Michael Finch. Michael Finch is a freaking legend. Jeffree Star. Mm. Shiny Grimmond, but she doesn't post as often as I'd like her to. Casey Raiden, like her as well. You guys. I just want to show you guys I don't have any eczema or anything. I'm going to eat this. <laughs> and if it comes up, we're going to know if my eczema does play up again. Y'all will know why. I thought it was just like soft crab shell. Like I just thought it was crab. I didn't think it had batter on it. The worst job you have ever had. I was a membership consultant for a gym. And mind you, at that time, I was not into fitness or 
wasn't like I didn't even know how to bloody lift a dumbbell like I was I was just this skinny girl and I got the job um, I just found like I had to be really pushy in that job like I had to sign people up and I had to call people and get them to sign up to the gym and it just wasn't me like it's not in my nature to to um, be pushy like when it comes to sales and stuff it's not my style I don't like it I don't like being pushy um, I don't like having bosses telling me what to do by being pushy so yeah that's gonna be the worst job I've had um, who did your makeup for your wedding I did I did my own makeup um, I did go for a trial initially with a makeup artist I'm not gonna mention their name um, but she was absolutely amazing like she's talented she's a very talented girl but I just didn't feel like myself when I looked at myself I was like mm, I prefer the way I do it um, also because this person was charging heat like I'm talking a few hundred dollars just to do my makeup and I was like, should I just do it myself? Because I love the way I do it on myself. And I didn't want anything too crazy as well. Like, I just wanted something very simple. I just wanted to focus on my skin. I didn't want to have like dark eyeshadow or anything like that. I wanted to look like myself so that when I look back at my photos when I'm 80 years old, I'll be like, yeah, you look good. Like, you look like you. Um, yeah. But it did take me two hours to slay my face. I took my time. Like, I baked my face to the teeth. I took my, I didn't rush it. I was in my zone. And it was good because I was home alone while I was doing it. And Jace was out oh, having breakfast by himself so I was wasn't getting interrupted or anything like that does it feel different now that you're married okay so you've only been married for just over a month and honestly it does feel different but in a good way I just feel, as a woman, it just makes you feel really good. Like, I know a lot of people are like, oh, it's just a piece of paper. But I just feel complete. Like, inside, like, in me, I just feel like I'm somebody's wife and I've just got a responsibility now. Oh, that's what I was going to say last time. Um, you guys are probably wondering if I'm going to change my name on social media. I won't be changing my YouTube name. Um, my YouTube and Instagram name will stay the same. And on Facebook, I've already um, put a request through to change my surname on Facebook. Because that's where I have all my family and friends on there. So I just thought I'd change it on there. But keep it the same everywhere, everywhere else. I absolutely love rice. Like rice makes me so happy. But I don't know. The crab shell thing. Like I'm not too sure. I think there's like a bit of milk in here. I don't know. It didn't really go down very well when I tried it. So I'm just going to that aside but what I will do I'm gonna grab my acai bowl I got this earlier on today so I'm just gonna grab that yeah so this has been in the fridge since this 
morning, so I'm just going to eat it now. Um, so it's a gluten-free acai bowl. How delicious. Oh, love it. Those are the only requests that were made on my story. I only posted it about an hour ago, so there wasn't many, but mm. I'm going to show you guys. I bought AirPods. Um, my local JB Hi-Fi finally got them in stock, so I bought them straight away. And I got the second gen. How cute is it? So it comes in this little box thing, and then you charge it, like, like you pop your charger through there. They're so tiny. I honestly hope I don't lose them. Look how tiny they are. And I'm just gonna pop them in. This is the first time I'm popping them in my ear. <gasps> I love them. God, they're so comfortable and they don't fall out of my ear. Love, love. Like I seriously cannot wait to go for a walk tomorrow morning so I can use them. <laughs> I'm just about to type in YouTube Q&A questions and then I'll just answer some questions for you guys, I guess. What did you always wanted to try but never found the courage to do? Probably skydiving. I was listening to Will Smith's motivational speech the other day and he was talking about skydiving and how it's so nerve wracking but then when you finally jump off, it's like the best feeling in the world made me want to go and do it but I just know I won't be able to do you enjoy being out in nature 100% I very rarely went out and enjoyed nature when I was younger I was pretty much a workaholic so all I did was work go home work go home but now I definitely enjoy my walks um, I've been on a couple of hikes. Um, I love the smell of grass and trees and flowers. Oh, it tastes so good. Mm. Where do you like to go when you eat out? I like to go to Thai restaurant because they have a lot of gluten-free options and dairy-free options. I actually had some Thai the other night with my girlfriend and we have octopus. Oh, they're like baby octopus, but they were like well done. So nice. Seafood restaurants as well. We recently found a place near where we live and they've got a really good variety of seafood dishes. So yeah, I love seafood. Do you like to cook? Yeah, I like to cook. I like cooking for my now husband. Because <laughs> um, he appreciates whatever I cook him. I do like cooking them because you know what goes into the food. And you can put whatever you want. Whereas when you eat out, especially here in Australia, it's so like, everywhere is the sort of same. You have your steak, your chicken, your seafood, but when it comes to like vegetables, you're so limited to what you can have or like a salad, or if you say vegetables, it's just broccoli and carrots and mash. 
whereas if you cook yourself you can add whatever vegetable you want you can have cauliflower you can have green beans you can have like there's so much things you can add yourself i ran out of memory on my cart so i had to switch it over what would your perfect day be like um go for a walk play with makeup um hopefully get some pr packages in the mail <laughs> open them up um, talk to my sister um, spend time with jason Maybe go online shopping for some cheap clothes. Mm, have a really good dinner. And go to bed early. I get so angry at myself when I stay up late. I like going to bed early. And when I say early, I mean like my 30, 10 o'clock max. And I'm just about done, you guys. Last one, when are you the happiest? I am the happiest when I know everyone else around me are happy. And that is definitely when I'm the happiest. I'm such an emotional person, so if I'm around you and I feel that you're not happy or if you're in a down mood or there's something wrong, it affects me. So, yeah, as long as everyone else around me is happy, I'm happy. Um, and yeah, just knowing that my family are all good, nothing's wrong, definitely happy. I honestly try to appreciate as much as possible and I'm just so grateful and thankful for everything. And yeah, I'm just trying to enjoy this journey of life. So. I'm just going to end the video here. I'm so full. So, so full. But I just want to say thank you so much for watching this video. And if you enjoyed it, please give it a big thumbs up. Like, comment, share and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.